So here we are, we open a new tab. We go to the website console.developer.google.com and this gives you access to the uh, API environment and the API is going to be used by the Bird Box. So uh, they've made it pretty well, so you simply follow the process again. You agree with the terms of services. Hit the buttons. Takes a little while, but create a project, follow the process again. So everything, this is called a project, so this, this under this account we're going to use one project and uh, I just copy the details again here in my little notepad. Project. Okay. Create. And we're going to actually create two APIs one for uploading of the videos and the other one of reading the statistics. Okay. Uh, enable APIs and services. So this is the menu which is important. Here you see the credentials. But first of all we're going to enable the APIs. Hit the button. And then we can have a look what kind of APIs there are available. There's a, ver a lot of them. So oh, if we look at YouTube you already see appearing now the uh, data API version 3 and the YouTube analytics API. Um, so we're going to hit this one first, the data API, enable it. Also follow the process again. And I must say the whole setup of this menu changes now and then. So it might be when you use it that it, uh, that it changes. Okay, here we go here create credentials so what kind of uh, project we're we going to use we're going to use the data API what kind of product um, this is the, the type of uh, device which is going to use um, so we say other other UI it is important to use other UI user data prefer Yes, a user date in this case. Not now. Okay. So this looks all good. Okay, set up constant screen. Okay. Follow the process again. Internal, external, so only for testing purposes we do it. So bird box. Uh, let's create a when take a file. For example, uh, pictures. So we take a random bird box. So the one for this is the other one. This is me. Well, let's take that one. <laughs> Looks better. <laughs> so okay. Okay, this looks all good. Wait again until it's processed. Okay. Then we go back to the dashboard. Uh, enable the other API. So, YouTube again. Here this one. Enable it. Okay. So now we have here two APIs enabled. And the next step is now to create the credentials, which is going to be used by the Bird Box to actually uh, use that API.